um, issues like this can be can be can be contentious and controversial, but sometimes the responses can be a little bit more than is appropriate. Do you want to comment on that? Yeah, actually, it's a it's a really good point because the reality is a lot of these kids that are out here. They're out here um, even despite the fact that when they uh, when they promote this within their groups of friends, they get attacked, they get ridiculed, they get uh, you know basically hostile attacks, and it's it's unfortunate because we've gotten to a point in society where uh, it seems like there is no moderate discussion anymore. It's either you're on one extreme or the other, and there's there's no in between, and there's no there's no willing to have a discussion or have a negotiation about anything anymore. And I think this this is one of the things that unfortunately you see trickle down from Congress all the way down to everyday Americans, and it's unfortunate. You talked about the students and their friends. Did you see it also on your Facebook page with people they don't know? I mean, from the public? Oh, absolutely. Uh, you know, on the on Facebook pages, uh, you know, you have to you have to monitor them pretty closely because uh, you get people that are completely uninformed and all they want to do is come in and, and uh, make hostile comments, ridicule, and then unfortunately you have to you know remove those because they're baseless, and then that has an impact on an open, honest discussion as well. Have you seen some hostile comments on there, some threatening comments? Oh, for sure, for sure. Matter of fact, we've seen it uh, on all these kids with their social media. Uh, they get they get ridiculed uh, with regard to just wanting to go back to school and start to play sports again. And then immediately somebody says, oh, well, you want to kill everybody or you're racist or whatever it is. And it's, it's, it's sad and ridiculous, actually.